Alright everybody, welcome to Shadow Hearts 2 Covenant. Obviously the second game in the trilogy. Uh, before we begin, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, support me on Patreon, and spread the word online about what I'm doing. Um, I still do not have the third game, Shadow Hearts from the New World. Uh, if I do not get a comment on YouTube from somebody who would like to lend or donate the game so that I can record it, um, I will be moving on after I finish this game. Um, if I do happen to get the game months from now, um, I'm probably not going to record it uh, right away, but... I don't know, it just depends. But probably not. The longer it takes for me to get my hands on it, the less likely I am to uh, record it. So, if you want to uh, see the third game recorded, uh, better find a way to get it to me soon. <laughs> Alright, let's dive in.
Lance as much as I can remember. The following day, Lieutenant Koenig, you were found by the Metz Highway, along with Sergeant Robert and eight survivors. Yes, sir. It's quite a story, but it seems we'll have to believe you. General, just give me another- Lieutenant! Karen, I've already decided to do that. I'm sending you back to that village. But this time you'll be a guide. Me, a guide? Our forces invaded France from the north and have managed to push back the Western Front beyond the Meuse River. But that village alone has stubbornly refused to surrender to us and continues to remain outside the Empire's grasp. Dom Remy may be beautiful, but it has absolutely no strategic value to us. But for the honor of the Empire, we must not allow anyone or anything to stand against us. Even if we have to face a demon itself. Is that clear? Yes, sir. Hmm. This is Cardinal Nicholas Conrad. He's come all the way from the Vatican. Nineteen <laughs> fifteen. Early spring, the world is in the middle of a huge upheaval. It started with a single shot, and the fire of war spread within a single instant. All of Europe was engulfed, and the struggle soon grew into the first worldwide war the human race had ever known. From a corner of this battlefield, our story begins once again. The graphics are supposed to get better, not worse. <laughs> Damn.
saving in this game is kind of slow as well. Is this your first time at the Vatican? Um, yes. I need to do some careful preparation before we go to Dom Remy. There's a certain item that I must have in order to complete this mission. A certain item? Yes, a sort of good luck charm. It's used for exorcisms. And that's where we're going now? Yes, it's inside a Poina Tower. Also known as the Tower of Atonement. It seems you know of it. For many, many years, dangerous heretics and others like them were kept in prison there. It's filled with the spirits of those who went mad from the torture. That's why it's a safe resting place for the item that I seek. But why am I coming? Well, to get to the top of the tower, I need your help. I'll feel much safer if you're with me. I took one fucking step.
Don't mess my clothes up. Those were easier than most. Are you all right? Uh, I'm fine. The font style in this game is quite disgusting. It's really an eyesore. Um, I'm not sure whether that tutorial was fast speed or not. I'm gonna wait for the first uh, subtitles or whatever and see how fast they go. If they're not faster than this crap, then I'm going to instant.
May they receive God's mercy. I'd say so far about 65% of the visuals are unappealing. <laughs> anyway, uh, we're going to get into the next video here. Uh, I think we've got the basics down. And uh, hopefully I'll pick up the new system quickly. Yeah, if you guys didn't know, uh, the game is fairly, fairly different from the first one. So uh, we'll see how long it takes me to get a hold of.